All right, let's do another one. I'm gonna put that out after I get back home. I like this part, it's kind of cool under here. So let's see what else we pick up. I'm tired of picking up that kind of energy. I ain't lying. Okay, let's pick up something else. Angels and spirits, let's see. Give me some good energy. Something good. Please, thank you. Um, let's get another energy. Let's see what else I see. Wow. Oh. So, this is another random read. I'm going by what I see. Okay. Okay, I feel like somebody got like a, a get-together coming up. I do feel like somebody's going to plan a party. You may even have... I heard a caterer. I see a lot of people together and everything. And that's not for everybody, but... Was this August? Leo season? Happy birthday then, Leo. Oh, well, it could be a birthday party too then. And I see a, a somebody must be renting a jumping house. A jumping house, you know, where the kids get in there and everybody jumping and playing and stuff like that. Okay, I know everybody ain't got kids, but that's why I'm picking up. I'm going to pick up what I pick up. And I feel like Somebody could be going out. I mean, it look like you could be doing something for yourself. Um, getting your things together. Looking good. Looking good. Dressing up. Looking real good. And I'm seeing, shoot, I just heard somebody either worked on their car or going to get another car. Or thinking about getting another car. Maybe you're cleaning it out. And I'm seeing a lot of drinking. <laughs> I heard drinking. Somebody could be drinking. I heard somebody got that loud uncle that's going to show up. Could be a loud uncle, but it's a male. <laughs> and let's look. I feel like somebody mad at you for leaving them alone. And this person want to come back to you, but somebody is like mm -mm, not really wanting to deal with this person anymore, probably because they lied too much. I'm seeing you got haters because you cut every, a lot of people off. You cut a lot of people off, so you got haters. And I feel like at this time, you got a lot of people jealous of you. Somebody got a lot of people jealous of them. And I want to say you manifesting right now. You're making things happen for yourself right now. And I want to say somebody even manifesting money because your money ain't right where you want it to be at this time at all. So you're manifesting money, but somebody manifesting love, but you don't want to take love too serious this time. You want to take your time. And I don't know why I heard steaks. Maybe somebody cooking steak. Oh, yeah. See there? I knew it. See? Ace of Pentacles. So you got a new beginning coming for you. New home, new house, new job, new business, something like that. Um, so you probably thinking about money at this time. Um, somebody here is in manifesting winning winning the lottery or the bingo or something like that or the bingo ship boat, what you call that boat? The boat, casino boat. And somebody won't need some money and they're gonna take care of their kids with it. Not everybody got kids, I know, but I see kids and somebody spending their money on the kids. Yeah, you got some finances coming to you, you sure do. And I feel like at this time here, it seems like somebody is chasing you right here. I feel like it is time somebody coming in to apologize, apologize to you, but you running them away or you pushing somebody away because you don't really trust them. But I do feel like somebody dealing with a love or somebody flirting with them right here. And they feel like you put them in a bad situation because I don't know if you want them or not. But this person thinking about you because they, they feeling like they had like, or they, 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 they know they can have a good time with you. But um, some you got trust issues because you always dealing with the seven of swords. So sometimes the seven of swords, you know, some you know, sometimes you pick you make the wrong decisions. So that's probably why you're taking your time because you make the wrong decisions. Because that's probably why you're taking your time. So you know you got an apology coming into you right here. Somebody gonna come off real sweet. 
um, well, whoever this person is, they put themselves in a situation they don't want to be in. Yep. And they knew they was doing wrong, but they did wrong anyway. They did. Okay, throw one on this new money. Throw one on this money and work. The lovers. So somebody want to uh, start a, a, a beginning with you. Somebody want to be with you. They do. Look at this. But I feel like somebody had lied about something, so they got to go through a breakup. There was a breakup. And I feel like, you know, unexpected. This person fell in love with you or something. But this person was lying to you about something here. But they come in to offer you a proposal. They see you as successful. Could be dealing with a Cancer or Vir a Virgo, a Taurus, a Leo. As if I say Virgo, that's what it is, too. And a Gemini. And, ooh, why are you cutting somebody off? You cutting somebody off right here. Um, you giving somebody a hard time. You are. <laughs> because of the truth, it's like... You kind of don't believe them or something. You got trust issues. So you're cutting off people and things that don't serve you anymore. Because you have been through everything in the world. Here, you was like, I already been through all of this, man. I ain't got time. So you got somebody coming in right here. Let me see. But then some kind of trouble. Yeah, that's probably the person you cutting off. And this person feels stuck. Like, yeah, they do. They want to talk to you, though. They, uh-huh. They do. And I feel like at this time here, for some reason, you're telling this person, I'm all right, I'm good. And I feel like probably because, you know, you know, you're just probably just taking your time. Pretty like that. So let's look at this Queen of Swords here, energy. See, you know you got another side. Yeah, the truth. Um, You know the truth. You're very psychic or whatever. Because, you know, the Queen of Swords can be very in intuitive. Libra Gemini Aquarius. I see a Capricorn and a Leo. So, it's like you know something about somebody here, and this person is probably a narcissist or manipulative. Maybe that's why you're cutting this person off. Also, you you cutting the devil off here. Somebody cutting off their toxic habits. Drugs, drinking, alcohol, food addiction, sex, whatever. But I even feel like somebody working on their self. They're working on their weight. They weight or their attitude. So, you said you know you got another side of you, and you said that you ain't playing with nobody right now. So, you got your guard up. And you starting to manifest. Matter of fact, you becoming very spiritual. But somebody said they ain't giving up on you. And somebody said they love you for real. You giving this person a hard time. Because you don't trust them or something. <laughs> this person, person find you very attractive. But it's like you know that this person, I heard, stood you up or something. Uh-huh. They didn't keep their word. They didn't keep their promises. They want you, though. And this person see you is very strong. You getting real close to this person. They feeling like something ain't going. Well, they feel like something ain't going their way with the other person or whatever. So it's like they want you to get them a chance, but mm -mm, this person lies, sneaky, cheater, thief, and very sexual too. So this person said they got to work on themselves because the communication is to me kind of bad because probably because of you. You don't want nothing to do with this person, or you just giving this person a hard time. That's what it looks like. So you're dealing with somebody very sweet. They're coming in and offer you love. They, they is. Somebody said they had to cut somebody off here. They were dealing with somebody that was um, very um, dependent on them, probably for finances. So you look like you're going to be doing good. Look like you're concentrating on work right here. Two, you're cutting everybody off so you can concentrate on your, your job, your work. So, the magician being revealed to you right here would, well, this person trying to manifest you because they in love with you. They is. But I feel like at this time here, it's like, shit, I see somebody keep trying to come back to you, though. I ain't lying. And this person evil, though. And they tried to show you unrequited love, and they, they kept lying to you. So, I want to say... Somebody want to speak to you right here because they put themselves in a situation. They in some kind of trouble. And they feel like something ain't going their way here at all. But you said you're doing you. You looking at this person like they're crazy right here. Probably because y'all was real close. But this person want to work on things with you. Um, Either you're going to give somebody a chance or you're going to give somebody another chance. But um, I want to say be careful about the chances you give it this time. Okay, so I want to say... At this time right here, somebody could be dealing with somebody with an age difference. They're kind of immature. And you be trying to put this person in their place and every, every, you know, at this time. You be trying to put this person in their place because 
You already know what you want. They probably just don't know what they want. So you're very defensive to this person right here. You are. And you're standing your ground with somebody here. And you're standing your ground for your happiness, too. So you're going off doing what you want to do at this time. That's what it looks like to me. So somebody wants you to take them back, but I don't know. You look like you wasn't happy. Well, this person now look like they're very depressed here, too. I see somebody getting ready to take a trip. They're going a long way. Somebody could be talking to somebody at a distance. Throw one on the world. So you completed a cycle. No, somebody completed a cycle and want to start a cycle with you because they find you very, very beautiful. But it's like you know that this person had something that was going on. Yeah, you might even been dealing with somebody being in jail, too. I see jail. I'm, I'm for real. So it's like with the Seven of Cups, that, yeah, I can see somebody had other options. So somebody tried to put black magic on you right here. Mm -mm. But it ain't work. And, but yeah, this person was trying to be real sneaky when they did it. Somebody that was real evil right here didn't want you with somebody at all who loved you. So, I see this person right here in this third party. Let's see what they doing. They moving. And you done been pissed off and you mad. So, let me look what you doing. <laughs> you ain't talking to them. <laughs> okay, so that may be why this person depressed and sad. Somebody very upset because you ain't talking to them. Um, This person said, they, you know, they may move on here. Mm-mm. But the communication was bad between you and this person right here. Probably because of a third party. So it looked like you right here starting, you know, trying to start a, a shit like a business. And you got a lot of haters. I ain't lying. So you do. And I feel like at this time, yeah, but somebody real sneaky. Why is this person so damn sneaky? Um, Like you was real good to this person right here. Somebody was real sneaky because they wanted something from you or their intentions wasn't good for you. Maybe that's why you cut them off right here. Because you didn't trust them at all. Throw one on the, on the Queen of Swords up here. Change. Hmm, you got a positive change coming for you right here. She looked disappointed. She feels played here. Somebody was rushing in trying to get that money. That's what it looked like, but it had secrets and stuff like that. But secrets came out, and you know it, because somebody was trying to play some kind of mind games. Somebody was even dealing with somebody that was on drugs. And so it's like, use the boss... Oh, you the boss, but this person right here wants control. And I want to say somebody did something here, like, had a, they were lying about something. Somebody was even lying about some children or a baby. And I heard you was getting tired and you needed some rest. You needed a break because you was looking at the snake. So you stayed to yourself at this time. That's what I'm seeing. I heard you were disappointed. And it seemed like at this time, see, yeah, you had like a heavy burden on you. You had a lot going on. But people who need you, they be walking behind you right here. And you love some of these people, but you cut a lot of people off because you're like, you know, I ain't got time. So I feel like whoever you love right here, which is yourself, had other options. Show sure did. Show sure did. And the communication got bad between you and this person. Probably was no communication at all. Matter of fact, somebody went out of town, didn't even answer their phone. Now, I don't know who that's for, but that's for somebody. Yeah, because they were juggling right here. This person said, oh, look at this person. They coming in real quick right here. They driving real fast, too. They want to give you something. Whoa, money luck is going to be good for you, though. Whoa. So, right now, it's like you need to focus on your money. You must have left somebody out in the cold. Now they're having a hard time. But they ain't know how to treat you right. I'm seeing it. They ain't know what they want. They know how to treat you right. They ain't know what... They just didn't know what they wanted. And this person right here, like, want to come close to you, want to get to you because they feel like you're true love. And yet they feel like that, that y'all can work it out. But you're telling this person no because, see, this person was giving it to. And you was good to this person, but they were trying to be sneaky and they were trying to do stuff behind your back. And then you was having too many problems with this person right here, too. And you wanted, you know, you just was looking for fairness, things, you know, to be balanced for you. And dang, but there was a broken heart here. And somebody here wound up in a hospital? Okay, somebody was having heart issues around you, an older person? They did. They was. Uh, somebody got somebody watching over them from the other side, but I also feel like somebody could go in the hospital. Get real sick. 
unless you got somebody in the hospital. This person here thinking about money right here, I ain't lying, but somebody was dealing with like a thief or something too. Not everybody, but somebody was. I feel like, yeah, but you got somebody coming in, it look like they begging on a little bit and me trying to apologize right here, but you know, it look like you don't want to hear it from them at all, like it just do. See, cause somebody had a sexual addiction right here and something didn't go in their favor at all with the other person that they had chose over you right here. And they was trying to do you wrong, but they want to come back to you. They got caught. I feel like they did because communication got bad between you and this person. You really cared about them. But at this time, somebody focused with money. Money. Somebody feels played about money. Somebody feels played about money and they disappointed. It could be you or the other person. So whatever truth you needed to know, I feel like you already know it. And, ooh, but you got some, this person here, I ain't gonna lie, is in love with you. Like crazy. And they pissed off at you. Probably because they know that you're very important to them and you're healing and you're getting over them. Yeah. Because they didn't get the reaction that they wanted to get out of you. They was coming in with a proposal towards you, though. But somebody looks very disappointed, either you or the other person. Because, see, somebody was greedy. They didn't care about nobody but they self. And they was thinking about money. And it seemed like I heard, hold on, yeah, they, yeah. Throw one on this four of swords. See, somebody was lying about something and keeping something to themselves too. Yeah, see, you were dealing with somebody who was thinking about money. I feel like you know it, you knew it. Maybe that's why you were disappointed. They ain't happy either. They probably ain't happy because you figured them out. Because they see you as being successful. They see you as a new beginning. They see you doing good. But you see them as getting in trouble and dealing with a bunch of karma. And you see them as holding secrets, and you see the communication that was bad between you and this person. Now they depressed, and they worrying. Why? Oh, probably because it didn't work out with them. With the other people that they chose over you. And their mind games didn't work out either. And you find out how manipulative this person was. So they want to be with you. But no communication, no talking. Y'all wouldn't see it eye to eye. So somebody being real choosy, real choicy. And you're moving forward with your success here because you know you, you know how good you really are to people. But you were dealing with a sneaky cheater, lying thief or something that's disappointed and upset and they depressed because they were trying to get away with something that I don't feel like they got away with at all. I ain't lying. So you was thinking about your money here and doing what you need to do. Matter of fact, you finna get everything you need. Somebody finna get a new house, new home, decorate a house or decorate a home or something like that. Because see, somebody mm -hmm, was doing, wasn't doing so good. Probably the other person. See, this person was cold. They was. They was. Somebody wants to be cold to you, they want to come back to you. Okay? You look like you love yourself. You was in love with this person, but this person was in love with sex with you or something like that. Okay? So, but you ain't stunting them right now. And you told them you would rather get a vibrator. <laughs> or, or a blow-up doll if you're a man. <laughs> so, whoa, look at this. Okay, whatever. You finna get a small chick right here, and somebody is definitely confused. Why? Because you moved. And something ain't going their way. They want to come back to you, but you told them, you're doing you, you're working on yourself, and you made up your mind, and they must be crazy. Because this person had, you had competition, and you finna get a lawsuit from the courts. That ain't for everybody. And you manifesting and whatever you think right now is coming towards you in a good way. So you started doing good or something. Okay. So whoever was cold to you, you cold to them now. That's what it looked like to me. They want to come in and give you a small offer. It ain't enough because I don't feel like it is because I, I feel like he was like, you know what? You're going to take me out my damn character. I ain't got time. I ain't got time. I ain't got time. You better come. You come. You better come correct. You know, because this person right here, it was being real mean. No lie. But this person could be in some trouble though. They could be. Um. Or. Wait a minute. Or they gonna get in trouble for messing with you. Yeah, cause there's gonna be a court issue. If somebody chasing you right here that was doing you wrong and they trying to come in and apologize to you but it's a trap 
It's a trap. So be careful. It's a trap. It's a real trap. Okay, that ain't for everybody, but for somebody it's a trap. All right, now let's look. 